what's up guys this is how you was nemesis and welcome to another video in this video we are going to be bypassing activation lock or icloud lock to owner or iphone lock to owner so this is iphone 6 this is an iphone 6 that is currently locked i do not know the apple id or password that is associated with this iphone meaning i will not be able to activate my device so in this video we're going to be using a special tool to bypass this activation law we will not be entering the apple id or password since we don't know we'll be bypassing this so without further ado let's start uh, the bypass okay so the tool we are going to be using today um, is called joy share so as you can see when i try to activate my device with the real tools um, when i try the activation Yeah, you can see that there's an Apple ID bound to this iPhone so I, I cannot activate without uh, providing that Apple ID and password so we are going to bypass it so we are going to be using the joy share activation unlocker this tool is very very simple to use this one click away and then you're done and it's it's relatively very very easy and they have a very very good uh, price to price plan I'll show that later but let's get to um, the supported system so on Windows um, it supports Windows 7, 8, 8.1, Windows 10, and then 11. So you can use um, 32 and 64 bit GPUs, and then at least you should have one gigabyte of RAM, and then hard disk should be at least eight gigabytes. Yeah, you should have all this, and then on Mac, on Windows system, yeah. So on Windows system, you have this, and then on the Mac versions, um, the Mac support um, from iOS 12 to iOS 14.8 which requires Mac OS 11 10.11 .11 to 13 and then for iOS 15 if you want to bypass from iOS 15 to 16.5.1 it requires Mac OS 10.15 to 13 so at least you have one gigahertz um, CPU or on the M1 or you have you have to have one gigabyte of RAM inside your Mac, and then the hard drive should at least have one eight gigabytes of free storage or more. So this is very very important. You must have iTunes installed before the, you 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 start with the bypass or even download this software. You should have iTunes installed. So what are the devices supported by this software? So well, if you have a Mac. This is supposed an iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, and then the iOS version for all these phones should be between iOS 12 to 16.5.1. So all iPhones from 5S uh, up to iPhone X, you can use this software. It should it, it should be between iOS 12 to iOS 16.1. You can bypass. It then supports iOS 11. So it's if it is between iOS 12 to 16.5.1, you can use the Mac version. And then when we come to the Windows version, it supports from iOS 2 up to the iOS 14.8 only. It doesn't support iOS 15, 16, and 16. It doesn't support. So if you have an iOS 15 and you want to bypass, you should reconsider and then use the Mac version instead. But in this video, I have an iPhone 6 which is on iOS 12. Point, I think 12.5 12 point something like that 12.5 yeah point 0.7 so I'll be using the Windows version to bypass um, this so it supports a, a lot of varieties of devices so let's let's just you can hit download here or you can go to the overview and then you click on the free trial so the free trial gives you um, a lot a, a lot a lot of um, I've already downloaded so it gives you a lot of advantage a lot of tools to use for free so I've already downloaded so I will not download again so I'll just go to my download side and then launch the tool from there so program yes and this is the iPhone activation on local software so I'll just double click it and then install so once the installation is done we'll continue 
okay so i just want to walk you through the step so we'll just click on next and then next create desktop shortcuts yes and then install so now it's going to install um make sure that you have at least eight gigabyte like i said eight gigabyte free storage because you're not going to be able to install this okay so the installation is almost done so let's launch the two Okay, the installation is done. It should, it should pop up in a second. If it doesn't, then we can manually launch it. Um, okay, so the tool has launched. So you have to read, read, make sure you read, and then accept the terms and condition, and then click on start so now we have to connect our device i've connected my device so i'll just go back and then click on start now it is downloading um the jailbreak tool so you need you actually need the jailbreak tool um, you actually need a jailbreak tool for the jailbreak because if you have to, if you want to bypass the the iPhone, you have to first jailbreak your device. I've already downloaded the jailbreak, so I'll just insert a USB drive. You use a USB drive and then insert. It should automatically pop up here. Yes. So you start the installation. I've already done that, so I'm not going to do that. So you just click on start the installation and then it will install the jailbreak on your device so after the jailbreak then you need to uh, boot your device i'll put a link in the description on how to do that you boot your device um, for the jailbreak and then jailbreak your device so i'll be back after the jailbreak so that we do the bypass so see you welcome back guys so i've successfully jailbroken my device like i said earlier if you do not know how to jailbreak your device I'll leave a link in the description box so you can follow the tutorial or the instructions and then you also jailbreak your device. So I've now jailbroken my device. Now I need to register um, the tool before I can use. So um, purchase the tool. You can see from their website they have the one year plan, the one month plan, and then the the lifetime plan. I recommend that you purchase the life um, lifetime plan, which supports five devices per one pc and they have 30 day money back guarantee so you do not have to worry about losing your money if this software doesn't work for you so i recommend you use either the lifetime or the one year plan which is very very affordable so i will register mine i will register my two and then when i'm back we'll continue the tutorial okay so i've done the registration so you can see there's no registration icons here so now I've connected my device now, what I have to do is click on start. Then we have to confirm that this is exactly the details on our device or our device's details, the serial number, the version, the model, and the name, whether it's an iPhone, iPad, or iPod. So we have confirmed, yes, this is my device. Now I click on start remove. Now it's removing. Just give it a couple of minutes. And then it says iCloud has been successfully removed. So do not factory reset the device or flash the firmware, or the device will be locked again. After restarting, if the device is stuck in the activation lock again, you can use the tool again to remove. So now this is the information that the tool has given us. So now let's get to our our, our phone, our phone right now. Yeah, so as you can see, the device has been successfully bypassed now you can use your device as normal you can um set up your apple id don't set it up here you can set it up in the app store as 
requested by the, the tool. So you can set it up here inside the um, the app store and you can use your device as you've always been using it. So now that that's it guys. So that is how you bypass iCloud activation lock with JoyShare activation unlocker. So see you next time. Bye bye. And make sure that you subscribe to this channel, like the video and leave a comment down below.